Hello, my name's Naomi and it's really lovely to meet you all. I'm from a group called Collective 31. We work with dance, drama, music and art. We're going to be doing some fun workshops with you over the next six weeks and we really hope you enjoy them. Let me introduce you to my friend Catherine. Hello, my name is Catherine and I'm also from Collective 31. I'm looking forward to working with Naomi to bring these workshops to you at home. They're going to be all about Snow White. Do you know the story of Snow White? In November, some of you came to the Compass Theatre in Ickenham to see the performance of Snow White. Don't worry if you didn't come, because we're going to tell you the story today. Snow White had an evil stepmother who wasn't very nice to her. She had a magic mirror. Do you know what the magic mirror said? Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest of them all? The mirror said that Snow White was the most beautiful and this made the evil stepmother very, very angry. She ordered the huntsman to kill Snow White, but he just couldn't do it. So Snow White ran away into the forest and found seven new friends. What were they called again? Oh yeah, the seven dwarfs. Now in our story of Snow White, we changed it and reimagined our own ending. The evil stepmother gave Snow White a poisonous apple, which she choked on and fell into a death-like sleep. The huntsman saved the day, and when he realised that the ribbon around her waist was stopping her from breathing, he released it. The dwarfs, huntsman and Snow White had a big party to celebrate, and can you guess what happened to the evil stepmother? She was so angry that she danced herself to death in hot iron shoes. Okay, so now is the time for a warm-up game based on the characters of Snow White to get us moving a bit. We are joined here now by my brother Max who's going to play the game with me. So, when I say number one, we're going to be happy dwarf and we're going to clap. Just like this. Right, so number one. Very good. When I say number two, we're going to be grumpy dwarf. You could do two things. You could do a good oh, slap your thighs, very grumpy. Or you could be oh, grumpy dwarf. Ready? So let's try that one. Number two. Oh. All right, let's put that together. So number one. Number one again. Number two. Oh. Number one. Good, I hope you get the idea. Now we're going to add in a number three. So number three, we're gonna be Sleepy Dwarf. So when you wanna be Sleepy Dwarf, we can either be, oh, sleep like that, or we could do a nice big yawn like, oh. Ready, so let's put them all together. Let's start with number one. Happy Dwarf, number three. Oh, Sleepy Dwarf. Number three again. Oh, sleepy. Number two. Oh, grumpy dwarf. Number three. Sleepy. Number one. Number one. Number three. Number two. Great. I hope you catch up with that. So why don't you pause this video and have a go playing it with someone in your household? You could say the numbers and see if you can catch them out. Great. Thank you so much for joining us today. We really hope you enjoyed yourselves and we look forward to seeing you next time.